Welcome my fellow citizens into our new video. Behind me there is a special ship that lies in my heart. Most of you who are watching my content already know that I really like 400i. But why is that? This ship is particularly not good in anything. It's not the best, not even close to best fighter. It's not the fastest. It doesn't have a big cargo. It is not special in anything. But what this ship excels is beauty. Some of the citizens really do not like the design of 400i. But the other side, like me, adores it, loves it and takes it everywhere. We have on this ship paired two size 4 deadbolts. We have one size 3 FR86 shield and what's most important is Quantum Drive XL1. Everything else you can leave stock. I didn't even change the missiles and this ship has a lot of them. So this ship is the ship that I take to cruise around, to enjoy, to fly, to have a good time. Now if you are a new player and you are wondering what to do in Star Citizen, there is so many things to do, there are a lot of missions and you will probably find a lot of interesting things to, to do, to have fun. But if you are like me playing over two years and you know almost everything that you can know in the game and you have played almost everything of course there's always something new to play but if you are here a long time you have to find another way to enjoy this game because this game is not like any other games this game is special it is special because you can create your own gameplay and for me this is 400i now, if you take a look at this ship, you will see that this ship is actually very beautiful design, very beautiful done. Everything is just in the right place. Look at this. You have a feeling in this ship that you are at home. You have a feeling that you are sitting at your dining table and waiting something to eat. Of course, without a helmet. But still, this is the ship that I want to own in a real life. If I could take one ship from Star Citizen into a real life, this would be it. It's not too big, it's not too small, it's like a house that you can live in and fly around the space as a solo or a small family. These are the captain quarters and here are the beds for your crew. Now the next thing that I really love this 400i is this bridge look at this bridge guys for me there is no better bridge than this one you as a captain and a pilot sit here in the middle of the ship close to the front of the ship you can see everything you have this beautiful wide screen yeah amazing beautiful you have a feeling that you are secure in this bridge. 600i has also very nice and beautiful bridge, but what that ship lacks is security. Even if that bridge is wow effect in glass and everything, you do not feel secure. You feel you can fall out of the bridge. Here you feel like you're in a tank. Look at this. And when we turn the ship on, right now all of the displays are in your view easy to see easy to reach four of them every information is there now if we take a outside of our beautiful ship you will see that we have a beautiful fortuna green paint this is one of the favorite paints for this ship for me and it's looked amazing the stock one the white one is also very very nice it suits the ship perfectly landing gear up let's go out if you have watched the Star Wars you already know that this ship looks like a Darth Maul ship and that is also one beautiful thing for me 
and the entrance when the stairs are coming down it's wow the next thing that i like this ship are these engines these massive beautiful engines let's turn them on look at this powerful beautiful look at the design of this ship glorious this little wing on the side yeah they are beautiful the placement of the back turrets is also amazing now why am i having deadbolts here well deadbolts are limited with ammo but they are powerful and they are going through the shield right now and that gives a strength to 400 i if someone attacks you you'll probably not be able to defend to fight it and kill him but what you will be able is to shoot at him a little bit and then run away because this ship is fast not the fastest but it's fast as said before the beauty of this ship lies not in his functionality but lies in his design and there's something in it that that you feel like you are at home when you are inside of this ship so yeah i would say this is my home ship okay let's do one mission just to have a sense and feeling of this ship let's try to do an ERT mission now I've said this ship is not the best fighter but you can still do a lot with it this is I think a um, luxury exploration and you can also use it as a passenger drive so in the future when that gameplay comes this ship will have a little bit more meaning we can distribute the shield wherever we like i'm going to push a little bit more to the forward because yeah i could be facing a hammerhead and hammerhead yes we'll try to deal with it with all of the missiles first and then go for a kill maybe at least we can damage it a little bit fire Oh, these missiles are hitting the target. A little bit more. I will still not go. Oh, these rattlers are amazing. Look at those missiles go. Go away, Karak. Okay, let's attack the hammerhead. Can we kill the hammerhead with 400 i? Let's see. Oh, he's shooting like crazy. He's not happy. But I think we have enough ammo to at least do it because they're going through the shield. This ship has a strong shield and it can tank a lot, so keep trying. The shield is going down also, which is doing us a favor. Okay, my shields are going down too. Okay, we know. We will now retreat a little bit to restore the shield I made a mistake I didn't put all power to shield so while we are retreating we will not allow the hammerhead to retrieve his shield fire come on rattlers do your thing damage him kill him he's coming back oh my god look at those rattlers do their job Okay, the marksman. Four of them. Why did he stop there? Fire all missiles. Oh, oh, look at them go. Reloading. Fire. Oh my god, this looks so amazing. Oh. 
Oh, he's returning the fire. Alright, last set of missiles. Come on, come on, come on, come on, fire! We don't have much more ammo. Okay, we have to reload and then come back. Fire! <laughs> I've tried it, okay? <laughs> Don't judge me. I said before, this ship is not great at killing targets, but it's great in running. But at least the hammerhead is red. While we fly there, we will have opportunity to enjoy the 400i in a beautiful quantum fly. I'm interested how this ship will react in new master modes. Hopefully it will be even better. What I would really like is another size 4 gun here on top of the ship. Look at this empty field. There should be a one more size 3 gun there. And then this ship would be perfect. For me at least. Oh, I've sunk some damage down. Those missiles are going right to the shield now and damaging your ship, which is not nice at all. Oh, it's gliding beautifully. Look at that Karak, it's a big ship. Fire. Time to kill Hammerhead. Oh, look at that one. Done. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let's kill that one too. Starfarer. Please don't curse, it's not nice. Oh, we can do a lot with this ship. Granted, not the fastest, but the more style. What's that? Phoenix. Oh, that Phoenix is mad. Whoa. Easy, buddy. Easy. The Phoenix is hundreds more times useful than this ship, but still we are fighting him. Nice. All right, I don't have enough ammo to deal with that Karak, but still, I'm going to leave. I'm going to use the best function of this ship, and that is run away. <laughs> Safety first. So guys, what do you think about 400i? Do you think that this ship is the most useless and also the best ship in the game? I don't know. For me, it is like that. Something special about this ship. The design, quality, it makes you feel right at home. Thank you guys for watching. Please, if you like this video, subscribe, like and share. And until next video, have fun out there citizens flying your 400i or whatever ship you like.